today we're going to be focusing on the neck. We'll do a very simple exercise that involves rolling the neck around in a figure eight pattern uh, 26 times, working your way up to 54 if you can. This exercise focuses on the throat chakra. It helps alleviate tension in the neck and also helps stimulate the thyroid gland. So how this will work, I'll do a demonstration. You will move your head to the left, down to the left shoulder. Uh, depending on your flexibility of your, of your neck will depend on how far it goes down. Um, you will then roll it down and allow your chin to come to your collarbone as close as it can, rolling until you get to the center. Stop for a second and then bring it back and then down to the right and roll it back around to the front and back. And you won't really want to stop as you actually go through the process. It will just be a very slow movement of the neck. A very key component to this exercise is the breath. The breath will be in and out the nose. Your inhale will begin at the left shoulder. Continue breathing in until you hit the right shoulder and then slowly exhale through the nose until you get to the left and you will begin again. So the breath is is timed up with the movement. Um, keep them both very slow um, don't strain the neck as you, as you move it. Very soft, gentle movements. So I wanted to read a little bit uh, from this book, uh, The Eight Human Talents by Gurmukh, about this exercise in particular. Um, in the science of kundalini yoga and meditation, breath patterns can do subtle and miraculous things for our body, mind, and soul. Since our brain is organized in hemispheres, anytime we do a right-left focus on the breath, we are helping the neural pathways in our brain to connect across those hemispheres. Linking the movement and the breath help to super-oxygenate the blood. Counting the times of the movement becomes a mantra that takes your mind's attention away from all obsessive patternings. So counting becomes a form of meditation as you do this exercise. And that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and do it 26 times today, but I encourage you to do it up to 54 if you can. Okay, have a good day.